There's a pretty one, Ulysses. Hello, BookTube. I'm Sean the Book Maniac. Welcome to my channel. Here I'm recording on Zoom. This is going to be a quick and dirty video. This is my second vlogmogram tag, and I'm not going to explain anything about it because I'm tired. It's been a long day, and I'm just going to tag two people. But all the stuff is in the show notes. Look at the guidelines. I'll put a link to my first vlogmogram tag, which you can uh, I explain it for four minutes at the beginning. And also Heather's first vlogmogram tag. She and I co-created this tag. Um, and uh, yeah, you get the hang of it. But for this video, I'm, I didn't, I'm really become lazy about doing any kind of vlogging. So um, I have maybe three things. One that I did today to send to Kenji because he's obsessed with mom and dad's dog, Katie. So here's a little footage of me throwing a little goldfish from my nuts and bolts at Katie because that's the way we feed her little snacks so that's really exciting here you go there you go I'll put in a couple random really old footage I think one or two from Japan. I'm not sure what I'm going to include, but it's just going to be random stuff because I'm just, you know, I did go out today and I didn't think to, to make any videos. I'm just kind of not in vlog mode these days. Anyway, the per first person I'm tagging is Heather of Soggy Expat Book Nerd. I didn't want to tag her in my first video because I thought it might confuse people who are trying to get the hang of the vlogmogram tag because you do not need to tag the person who tagged you. It's not a requirement of doing the tag, but you are free to do it. I just don't want anybody to think that you have to automatically give three prompts to the person who tagged you. Is it, it's, it's to go forward and go forth and multiply, but I, I want to tag Heather. And I, I can't, I don't have the, uh, the uh, deliciously demented mind that Heather does to come up with her uh, fabulous prompts, but uh, I have done my best. So Heather, here is your... Uh, here are the three prompts I have for you. The first one, I want you to free associate on this word. Talk about your personal experience. Talk about your opinions. Tell us funny stories, embarrassing stories. Um, anything at all, really. And if you have some vlog footage to, to go with it, all the better. Karaoke. Or as the Japanese say, because it's their word, karaoke. Um, when you when uh, they hear Western speakers say karaoke, they haven't got a clue what you're talking about. But karaoke, karaoke, have at it. <laughs> and uh, here's some more random footage. And uh, the second one I have for Heather is actually a vlog request. Uh, if you don't know me and my channel, um, hello, I'm Sean the Book Maniac, and I pronounce vlog, vlog. Welcome to my world. So vlog request for Heather. I would like to see a bit of really old video footage, um, like that ne you've never shown on your channel. And if, I want you to contextualize it. I want you to set it up. And so that we can vicariously enter this uh, video vignette from your past, or if or if you have a really old photo that you want to tell a story about, or both. But that's my vlog request. And the third one for the inimitable Heather of Saki Expat Book Nerd is without thinking about this, like you're gonna you're gonna see this video, and you're probably not gonna film your response immediately thereafter. But I don't want you to do a bunch of pre-thought or thinking about it, I'd like you to spontaneously create the heatherest, soggiest, expatiest, um, book nerdiest readathon for 2023. And I 
don't i want i want you to go wild and crazy come up with a, a wacky like i say the heatherist um soggiest expatriist book nerdiest readathon what would be the theme and what would be some of the prompts and would you actually go through with it and and, and um do it next year but mainly i want to hear what it would be <laughs> All right, and just a, one more random footage from my from my iPad going way back, probably. Oh boy, do I need a drink! This is a grapefruit sour. Sour is shoju, which is a. The, the alcohol is shoju, which is different, far, quite different from sake, and actually better. Very popular. It's based on the Korean liquor. It's almost tasteless. This one is made from barley, which is the most common type. And grapefruit juice. And as we say in Japan, Kanpai! And the second person that I am tagging on this version of the Vlogmagram tag is Nell of Book Hunt, formerly of Gunpowder Fiction and Plot. And don't worry, Scott, not only are you included in some of these prompts, <laughs> are you nervous? <laughs> but you'll, you'll, you'll get tagged in due course. Oh, I need some more wine here. So now, now I'm getting my second wind. All right, darling, now are you ready? Number one, your topic is Scott at Christmas. Besties and worsties, memory-wise, if you have some vlog footage, uh, any embarrassing stories, happy stories, well, sad stories if you want. <laughs> yes, Scott at Christmas, besties and worsties in the memory department. Secondly, vlog request. Something old and interesting in your place, in your neighborhood. And if that's your grandmother, I'd love to meet her. But I'm thinking of the old thing. But yeah, you just let your imagination run wild. And the third one is the book that we would be, I would be, but we, the royal we, would be most surprised to see on your shelf or on your infamous nightstand table and why do you have it what's the story all right that's it so the only thing i'm going to reiterate from what i did a couple days ago where you can get the full explanation is you don't have to wait to be tagged to do this tag so all the do's and don'ts are in the show notes have at it thanks for watching